Okay, so what we have here, this is a Kirshner Baby Grand. Uh, it is about 100 years old or so, and we brought this up from about 1,000 miles away. And I hope you've seen a pattern with these videos. Uh, Kirshner, you've probably never heard of the name Kirshner. There's hundreds of brands back then. Uh, we certainly do Steinways, we do Mason and Hamlins and Baldwins and the, and the better known brands, but this, is, this has been in their family since it was bought. And uh, it's a family heirloom and it's a decent little piano and it's certainly worth restoring. So uh, I, I, I picked this up and um, we're going to do a full restoration on this. I don't know if you can see from the camera, but it's, um, it's got some shading around the sides. Um, it kind of hides the grain a little bit. So when we're going to refinish it, it's going to be a, uh, we're not going to shade it. We're going to let the mahogany really come out and it's going to be a wonderful, wonderful little piano. So the first step in the restoration process is the disassembly. Um, you got to take everything off, all the, all the hardware off, all the parts, the hardware goes to the platers. I've already taken samples. I had to take some samples of the bass strings, sent them off to get duplicated. I've taken samples off each of the end sections of the keys. You see these notes are down, this note is down, these notes are down. Um, in order to duplicate from the Renner company, uh, the hammers, and we're going to put new shanks and flanges and whippings and everything in here. So the first thing is the disassembly. So from the first screw, to the last bit of 80 year old dust. <coughs> the disassembly is the first part of the restoration process.